We identify three points of training and uh, potential retaining of doctors in, in, in Ireland or in Sudan. And we identify the, the first entry point where post internship doctors uh, get the in, uh, trust examination with the Irish uh, Medical Council and then they get um, a basic training in surgical or medical uh, for two years in Ireland during the fellowship membership, uh, surgical or medical membership examinations, which is mostly an SHO level here. And the third uh, point is the higher specialist training, the SPR scheme, or uh, the, the retrospect recognition of the training uh, conducted here in Ireland, even outside the SPR scheme. So uh, the discussion started with the last point and uh, highlighted the new changes in the Sudan Medical Council legislations. And uh, one of the, uh, uh, the major recommendation here is that uh, the Sudanese doctors in Ireland needs to be enlightened about these uh, changes. And uh, whoever is getting a full recognition or a specialist registry in Ireland or UK will directly be considered as a consultant but there are new, less uh, levels of recognition. One at three years uh, of training, that is a specialist, and one after further three years of experience, that is a senior specialist. So we recommend that these uh, new changes need to be more communicated to the, the, the doctors in training in Ireland. And in the first part, there was a discussion about facilitating the communication between the Sudanese Medical Council and the Irish Medical Council to enhance and uh, uh, make the process uh, taking shorter time. And there was a discussion and a suggestion of uh, um, hosting uh, the trust examination first part in Sudan. We, uh, that would probably need further discussion between the two councils. Uh, uh, it is probably a, pre a more of a pre-registration examination than a postgraduate examination. So that, is, that was the second recommendation. The third one, actually, we didn't have a chance to take it further for further discussion, is the middle level as to where would the two years general professional training in medicine or basic surgical training in surgery fit if somebody quitted the system here and went back to Sudan. So we didn't have a chance to finish this, and that's it. Thank you.